In this video, we will look at how to add lessons to our school year for any type of course. There are two places that the add lesson links can be seen. First in the details of the course and then on the course planner. We begin on the courses tab. We click the details of this course and we can see the add lesson link here. We want to add a test day to fall between lesson four and five. Click on the add lesson. The system brings up this box. Add your date that you want the lesson to appear. We have added information in each box. Notice that several of these boxes are only visible on certain profiles, either the student or the parent. We click the save button and now the system takes you into the lesson overview for that lesson. In order for this lesson to be added to the lesson plans, we have to add an assignment to the lesson. Here we will add the week number for the test and we click the category to add this into the test category and click save. Going back to the course details, we can now see the system has added this test here. The second place you can add a lesson is from the course planner. Going back to the courses tab for Jonathan, we click on the details for physics. We have enlisted our homeschool engineer dad to help us with the labs on Friday. So we want to add these to the calendar for that course. We don't want to reschedule the lessons, but we can add a lesson here. Going into the course planner, we click the add options button and click add a new lesson. This view is very different from the one presented on the course overview. The system warns you how the lesson will be created and reminds you to save the changes. Now we can see the system has added our new lesson after that day's lesson, which is what we want, so we click Save and Reschedule. Notice that the lesson is not in date order in this list. We go back to the course overview, we can see the lessons are in the correct date order. We can also view them in the lesson overview, and notice that the system will move the student smoothly from each lesson. In this example, we wanted the lab's lesson to be added to that day's lesson for the course, and that is what it has done. However, if you want to shift the lessons, the hub will allow you to do this. Going back to our previous example, we can see in the course overview that the system has put the test after lesson five, but on the same day number. We want lesson five to be on the next school day. The easiest way to do this is to go to the calendar and click reschedule on lesson five. Click Move All Lessons and Save. Notice the system has also moved the test day. To put the test back on that Friday, we go to the lesson and click Edit Lesson. We change the date to September 2nd and click Save. Now click the Back to Previous page and notice that we have a test on September 2nd and the rest of the lessons have been moved. Going into the dashboard, we click the Next Day and see the system will take the student through the lessons as we have scheduled them. Here we can see what happens when you add a lesson that doesn't contain an assignment. The system has ignored this lesson and there is no unskip button. Going into the lesson overview and adding an assignment will move this lesson into the lesson plans. Keep in mind that once you add a lesson, there is no delete button. If you make a mistake, you can always just click the skip and replace. Click the save and reschedule button and the system will now ignore that lesson. After you add lessons to the lesson plan, the system may not always show the lessons in date order in the course planner. Just know they will show up for the student on the date they are assigned. In the same view, we notice that the lesson day number is missing on the lesson we added as these are set by the hub when the course was assigned. If having a day number and lesson number match is a requirement for you or for reporting, you will have to edit each lesson individually in their proper order to rework the lesson plans. The Add a Lesson link can achieve this result quicker and save you time. This advanced feature is just another way the hub makes it easy for you to create lesson plans that fit your homeschool needs. Thank you.